it just smells like baby powder you know like babies yeah a cute baby baby powder and you just want to keep smelling your baby hey guys welcome back hope you're well and i hope you're having a good week welcome back to my channel if you're new very welcome to you and if you're returning thank you so much for tuning in for this week's video so guys today i want to discuss my current favorites so these are perfumes that i just cannot stop wearing so i just wanted to do a quick video and just kind of discuss that with you guys so yeah if you're interested keep watching So yeah guys, as mentioned, current favourite. So today I am going to discuss four fragrances with you that I am absolutely just feeling right now and just keep spraying. I'm just liking it. And gosh, has it been hot or what? I mean, if you live in England, you would know there has been some crazy heat wave recently. It's too hot for me. Um, but I know some people obviously love it and yeah, all good. But for me, it's just like, whoo someone give me a bit of rain or something but anyway so, so the very first one that i'm going to be talking about is um miss dior or the form and this is by christian dior uh, so this perfume honestly this one i absolutely love it's just so light it's very floral it's everything that summer is in a bottle it's just so so simple yet fresh it's dewy it's fresh it smells very sort of rose floral type and it's just, for me, it's one that you can almost just sort of have in your handbag and you can kind of carry everywhere with you. And if you just need a little top up, you can absolutely just reach for it. It's very, very soft, very delicate, very, very feminine. And one thing that I love about this as well is the advert on TV. I think the advert is what drew me into this and that's what actually um, made me want this perfume. Um, but yeah, I really, really like this and I think it just kind of goes all year round. It's one of those that is very, very light. So even if you go like spray all over about 10 sprays, you will be okay because it's just not overpowering at all. It's very soft, it's very delicate, it's very feminine, it's very uh, just sort of summer appropriate. And I feel like this is one that you could probably get away with as well um, for the rest of the year. So around autumn, winter time, just because it's just got that, um, that little bit of simplicity to it. So yeah, I feel like you can just go with anything and sort of anywhere really. Uh, but for this time of the year, absolutely 100% appropriate. So this is one that I have been using quite a lot and I've been carrying with me everywhere because it's just everyday appropriate. So absolutely, absolutely love Miss Dior uh, by Christian Dior. The very next one is Vert Malachite. And Vert Malachite, I recently did a um, an unboxing on this. So this one for me was Love at First Sniff. So I knew I had to get myself a bottle. Um, so here it is, looks like this. And yeah, I just feel like that sort of marble um, top um, is really, really uh, stunning. Uh, so this is Vet Malachite. This one for me is just so, um, there's something that really drew me in with this. Uh, it's just something that I've never really smelt before. And it was almost like, okay, oof, that smells fantastic. Um, so yeah, I've got to get it. So since I got it, I have not been able to put it down. So this is also very, very rich in all the floral notes. You've got, it's got Ylang Ylang, got the Jasmine, Pink Pepper, Vanilla, Lily. Um, so this is more, uh, more floral than anything. So again, for this time of the year, super appropriate. I'm just gonna give it a quick spray on my arm there. So I've been loving this, absolutely can't get enough of it. And I knew that to be fair, when I first smelt it, I just knew that this would be one that it's just gonna remain a staple in my collection because it's just one of those that, yeah. It's lover's first sniff. When you know, you just know, don't you? You know, it's, it's essentially white florals. You've got your vanilla going on. Oh, it's just like, so so nice and very very pleasant to the nose and pleasant to the people around you as well it's very tropical it's very very just sort of heavenly i don't know what other word i could use to describe this but it's just kind of getting a sort of creamy it smells green it's just really intriguing and really really mysterious so yeah this is one that i've also been loving recently the very next one um, obviously i'm not doing any reviews on these guys this is just me just discussing my current obsessions. I have already done reviews on most of these fragrances. Um, so I'll leave, leave the link to them down below. My very next one is from Zara and this is Rose Gomand. Rose Gomand, Rose Gomand. I mean, what can I say about this beauty, beauty, beautiful fragrance? 
it is so stunning rose goldman is one of those that i find that a lot of people don't like it and i don't know why my sister was over the other day and she smelled this and she was like i can't smell anything i'm like are you all right smell it again spray it on your skin spray it on paper what do you mean you can't smell anything this is stunning and even my friend as well i'm like can you try rose goldman just try it when you're going to zara and she did and she absolutely did not feel a thing she absolutely didn't like it so i'm a bit like okay maybe i don't know what's going on but it's weird but i love it i think rose goldman is one of those you spray it people can smell you it is so so delicious obviously contains rose i think yeah the goldman name absolutely is appropriate for this because it absolutely is so so easy to obsess over you just absolutely love it and i think what this is one that when you wear it or if you quickly spray it, people can smell you from a distance so the cr is absolutely phenomenal um, and i have been absolutely loving this i know it's a bit heavy but i have been carrying this in my handbag okay it is heavy but hey ho it's, the, it's just the price you have to pay for smelling great you know so yeah i absolutely really really love rose goldman and this is only 19.99 from zara so yeah absolutely obsessing over this absolutely loving it it is stunning i would highly highly recommend this I wouldn't say that this one is unisex, um, it's not. I would say this one is more uh, feminine, so just bear that in mind as well. A lot of the Zara fragrances leans more feminine, apart from two of the Oud ones. But yeah, Rose Goldman is fresh rose, got the vanilla, it's got the tonka, just everything that I love really. But I know this won't be for everyone, so get your nose on it if you haven't already. I absolutely love it, I think most people would love it. So yeah, it's definitely worth trying got the jasmine in there it just smells so delicious it's soft creamy caramelly delicious baked goods all that stuff that you want to eat uh, that's rose gumman for you so um yeah definitely get your nose on it so my final final one guys is um the favorite and this is about penalogans the favorite has always been honestly this is one that i just i can't rate it enough you know, so I just feel like it's so, so different, so stunning. But powder scent, I'm not really, you, you, I'm not usually into powder scents. I just kind of feel like they're a bit dated, they smell a bit vintagey, like an old lady, you know, all that kind of vibe. But this one changed the game for me. So this is the favourite by Penalegans. Um, and again, for this time of the year, absolutely stunning it just smells like baby powder you know like babies yeah a cute baby baby powder and you just want to keep smelling your baby that's kind of what the favorite reminds me of and it just not in a weird way it just there's just something so lovable about this so it, it smells very very powdery but not in a sort of old dirty type way um it's just a very very soft delicate feminine uh, fragrance um i just again cannot get enough of um i never can get enough of this um it's just a staple in my collection and i absolutely absolutely love it even the packaging as well uh this little bow here that's really like just soft and velvety um it's just absolutely absolutely stunning so these are my current favorites um uh, right now that i'm absolutely loving so i'll probably do something like this maybe again towards autumn winter time um yeah so i'm just i'm sure my taste would have changed by then because obviously the weather changes mood changes um and all that kind of stuff so we we'll definitely do an update on current favorites but right now those four are the ones that i am absolutely love it so yeah thank you so much guys for watching if you've tried any of this if you haven't tried any of this leave me a comment regardless even if you just like the video still leave me a comment just say you like the video Give this video a thumbs up of course and if you are yet to subscribe please do that before you go it's just a hit of a button it's not hard at all so yeah please please do that before you go follow me on instagram as well i will leave all the details in the description box below so thank you guys so so much for watching and i will see you very soon in my next video bye